Welcome to Anna American Accent. Today we're going to look at how we produce nasal sounds and how that makes a difference when you pronounce N and L. In order to understand nasal sounds, we need to know what the soft palate is. Your, the roof of your mouth is pretty hard, but as you go further back, it's soft. And you can see in the picture here, uh, they show the soft palate up and closing the airway. That's what we do with most sounds. And also lowered, allowing air to go through the nose. That's for nasal sounds like N, M, N, 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 G. So I have worked with pronunciation with certain people from just a handful of countries, especially Asia, where they get confused how to produce English N and L. And in order to help them, they have to learn how to control the velum, which is the most correct word or the soft palate as we call it. So when the, when we make an N, the air passage to the nose is open. So you actually lower it. And when you make an L, you actually raise it and close the, the passage there so that no air goes through the nose. Here are some minimal pairs with N and L in initial position. Night, light, nine, line, net, let, knock, lock. And here in final and medial position, bin, Bill, bone, bowl, connect, collect, winning, willing. Now, the way you can practice this, if you have trouble with this, is to put your tongue where the L and the N is, right behind your top front teeth and hold it there. Don't move it. And then try to produce N versus L back and forth. And that way you can start to feel what it, what it should feel like when you're raising it versus lowering it. And that will help. If you like it, please like and subscribe. See you next time.